Welcome back. Yeah. I had to go eat. I was starving. So, here we are back in uh, Hyrule. Oh, man. All these Zoras. Are you... Are you a uh, Hylian? Well, yeah. But, man... Before we continue on with this, I need to go and do what I originally wanted to do, which was... No, let's go back here. Which was see one of the the memories so we could uh so we could you know go and talk to Ampa and finish that off because it's gonna annoy me if I don't do it now I got all sidetracked with all the fighting in the thunderstorm and shit so Yeah, time your attack carefully, no kidding. Damn, you can really screw yourself over if you don't. Trust me, I know. Uh, we need to go... Uh, it's like over here somewhere. So, that way? Okay. What are you doing, kid? Should not be up here. Mommy's hiding, but I'll find her. Weird. Damn. That's twice now that Bloopy has shown up and I didn't react in time to shoot it. And you actually have to work to catch the fairies in this game. Like, you can't just whatever. Alright. Cool, cool. Let's continue down this way. It's very worth it to do this first because you get something. Are you serious? I don't want this shit. Heard that. Screw you. Freaking stone taluses. Gonna give me PTSD jumping out of the ground and shit. I see a core rock. Good throw. At least they charge up fast now due to the uh <coughs> the rune upgrade. Oh my god. Just drop it. Right there. So it won't fall anywhere. Give me that amber. I thought you were gonna kill me, goat. Ram, get out of here. Oh, 
I see another Korok. Well, first, let me talk to you. Who are you? Oh. I can tell you trained your body well. I say you're familiar with both sword and bow, correct? That's good skill set. Why don't you join the Yiga clan? Oh. Aww. Huh? You're refusing? The Yiga clan, it's... <laughs> powerful, brave group of warriors founded by Master Koga and dedicated to defeating the hero Long Thought Dead. I will take your life. <sighs> Welcome. This is the fucking Yiga clan. They will just randomly attack you out of nowhere. Oh, right in the fucking ankle. <laughs> Alright, this weapon's a little slow. Chill! Oh, you knew it was coming! Wait, did he teleport or did he die? And for some reason, he was a, an assassin for Chiquita Bananas. Anyway, yeah, that's the Yiga clan. I knew we were going to encounter them eventually, but I wasn't exactly sure when. God damn it. They're like the most... It's like more funny than anything to me, because it'll be like the most random, like, uh, fights. Like, it'll just be like this person will be talking about something completely non-related to assassination, and then all of a sudden... Haha! I love rabbits. Do you like rabbits? They're so cute and fluffy, and you will die. And then you're like, huh? <laughs> they always have bananas on them. I don't understand this. What is the connection? Oh, don't make me shoot shit, Korok. No, get down. Get ready for it. Get ready for it. Shit! Wrong way again! I keep just totally like bypassing where I need to turn off because I'm just like, oh this, oh that. I need to go... down this way. Yeah, here we go. Man. How did I not see this? I've even been here before and I'm still just bypassing it. If you don't want to get turned into drumsticks, get out of here, birds. You think Colonel Sanders is bad? Uh, that, now that I think about it, why did that guy even ask me to join the Yiga clan if their whole purpose is to kill me? <laughs> Suckers. Money. Slime in a box. What's in the box? 
slime. Choo choo. You flew way over here. If this book yep. hoblin does not hear me coming, okay, he did. <laughs> that sound. I think because I was trying to push that block, or the box on the block. I see another core rock over there. Hmm. cheat this out and like just jump off the block end of the thing Ugh. hold on link and jump yeah yeah ha ha see another chest over there And I see a, a Zolfos. Okay, that's fine. Jump around. Just wait there. What were you waiting for? Actually, a whole bunch of Lizalfos over there. That's very convenient, come to think of it. Ugh! Oh, what the? <laughs> Just kind of bounced off him. Get out of here. I don't know how Leak didn't just sink immediately to the bottom with all that gear on. Places like Korok Alley. I'm getting distracted again, I know. It's so bad. Um, might as well just keep going. Because there's some chests over here, treasure chests, that I want to get. I think. Nice try, Link. I saw you trying to dive into the water. 
there's a raft over there you could take, but, you know, I'm already this far doing the ice cube trick. Behind every waterfall, there lies a secret. Get up there. Start climbing. Run out of stamina. Okay, never mind. We found a miracle ledge. Oh, look, a shrine. My bad, there wasn't chest, there was a shrine back here. There was chest too. Could be wrong. What was that? That was kind of a weird motion. <laughs> strange ambient music I hear in my left ear. It's the shrine. It speaks to me. at max speed. It's called galloping. Don't tell me this is under a test of strength. Oh no. Three boxes. Uh... And I know I did this because I remember there was something behind the waterfall, but I don't remember this. this actually tis a silly shrine oh god just no sword. Nice. There's one more. Oh, yeah. Let me guess another opal. 
Oh no, Amber. Well, nothing amazing, but you get the premise of why it's called three boxes now. I don't remember what I'm supposed to do with this box. Oh, yes I do. Yes I do! Climb, Link, climb! Wait, huh? No, Link! <laughs> Here's the thing. More spirit orbs. Okay. Now. Now on to the memory. Now, I couldn't tell you the order and all the memories you're supposed to check out. Oh, wait a minute. This. Like, I don't know if they're in, like, chronological or whatever. If they are, then I'm going to be doing this one, which is second to last, but... Eh, I don't think it really matters. I mean, because... If it's not... Obvious, the story is told through anecdotes and people's memories and whatever. So... And, you know, through, like, these memories that you're about to see. I haven't seen very many of them. I remember this one. And that's it. Really. Whoa. Whoa! Whatever. I can make it over to the Korok Island. Maybe. peanut galleries here. You motherfucker. Oh, shit. Wait, stand up. I don't want to fuck with you guys. I just want to get over here. Zolfos. Huh? What's that over there? Yes, bring out your... Oh, shit. Ow! Can't blow up the bomb while I'm on the mountain. Move, Link! God damn! Urgh. I need a faster weapon for these mother. Okay, here we go. No. 
No! Oh my god, this is just a terrible way to start. Piece of shit! Oh, come on! Damn, this fucking Bokoblin. Shut the fuck up. You and your fucking shitty spear. Oh, you guys want some? Oh, my bow broke. Great. I mean to do that. <laughs> fucking hell, man. That was just rough. That was all fucking terrible form on my part. And I love two handed weapons, but man, sometimes they can be slow. You know, minus spears, they're pretty fast, but. And you got dumbass. Dual Bokoblin combo teams where you have one's using a fast weapon, one using a spear. It's just real tough to like fight that with a slow two handed weapon. Granted, I'm not in top form either because I haven't really played this game that much. I'll get better though. It's like you just, well, I mean, first of all, you can't even do as many things with a two-handed weapon as you could with a shield and whatever, you know. That's the sacrifice you make. It's like, oh, well, you just trade for stronger, longer reach for mobility, be able to block and parry and shit. Alright, Moblin. Can't defend so much. death. Rest in peace, not. How's it feel to be poked by a crudely made spear to death? Here we go, finally we made it. Arduous trip down this uh, royal promenade or whatever it is, Leneru Promenade. Keep us in suspense. How'd everything go up there on the mountain? So you didn't feel anything? No power at all? I'm sorry, no. Then let's move on. You've done all you could. Feeling sorry for yourself won't be of any help. 
After all, it's not like your last shot was up there on Mount Lanayu. Anything could finally spark the power to seal Ganon away. We just have to keep looking for that thing. That's kind of you. Thank you. If I may, I thought you, well, I'm not sure how to put this into words. I'm actually quite embarrassed to say it. But I was thinking about what I do when I'm feeling. You know, what usually goes through my mind. It helps when I think, when I think about. <laughs> Stop wasting time. We're gonna need everything we got to take that thing down. Now, champions, to your divine beasts. Show that swirling swine who's boss. Link will need to meet Ganon head on when we attack. This needs to be a unified assault. Little guy, you get to Hyrule Castle. You can count on us for support, but it's up to you to pound Ganon into oblivion. Come, we should go. We need to get you someplace safe. No. I'm not a child anymore. I may not be much use on the battlefield. But there must. There must be something I can do to help. Zelda, it's not the time. It's interesting that the Gerudos, the race of Gerudos, are like good, um, good guy, good girls, I guess. I mean, they're all women this time around. You know, because normally, like, at least in Ocarina, they were like kind of they were, you know, Ganon was from their tribe or whatever, and oh fuck. Do you see that motherfucker over there? Let me tell you, we do not want to fight that. We want to get out of here very quickly. Oh, I didn't know he has an aggro meter. That question mark slowly started turning red. Yeah, we do not want to fight that. <sighs> okay, now that that is done, we can go back to Kakariko. I'm sure you're like, well, wait a minute. What did we just see? Who are those people? Well, they've mentioned it earlier. Those are the champions. You'll get more details on it as we go. And, you know, like I said, I don't... I don't really know if there's... there. I'm sure there's like a chronological order you go into, but I don't think it really matters. It's just kind of conveying to you the story of what was going on like... A hundred years ago. You know, in the time before Ganon showed up. Alright, Impa. Ah. I'll hand this over to you now before I forget. This is something of yours I have been keeping safe by request of the princess. This clothing was made specifically for... 
This clothing was specifically made for when you became a champion. Please handle it with care. Alright. So, that's why I wanted to do that, because you get the champion's tunic. And... It's, uh... It's kind of whatever right now, because it's the same defense as the tunic. Yeah! Yeah! No! Fuck off! I'm gonna go upgrade it. <clears throat> so it'll be even more defensive. I am not going the right way. There it is. There's the path. Before I, you know, get lazy and warp five feet away, it's just the other direction. And even if you tap A to sprint, it's just still like drains your HP or stamina. Oh, that would suck if it drains your HP. I already got enough problems staying alive. Champion's tunic is nice. As it says, it uh, shows the enemy's HP gauge. Yes, hello, I'm here again. You have to tell me this every time. <laughs> Crazy. Now, it's the best armor I have. So, a total of 18 defense. Alright. Wait, what is this? Why is it still flashing? But I did that. Oh, you have to do all of them. Oh, okay, it never goes away until you see all of them. <coughs> okay. So now we can head over back to where we were. And continue on with the next leg of the mission in the Zora domain, since, you know... They're looking for a Hylian! Hey, are you a Hylian? Awesome tunic, but that stupid spear. Oh. Consider how nice it would feel to know you saved us all. Aren't you getting a little ahead of yourself? I see him. That's one of these yummy things that I can use to cook. Alright, all right, here we go. We're getting to, like, as far as I've ever been. Like, we're going to Zora Domain now. Welcome to Zora Domain, motherfucker. Say hey there, young one. Up top, above you. Pardon the entrance, but you're a Hylian, aren't you? I was hoping perhaps you'd have a moment to talk. <laughs> yes, I am Hylian. Hmm. Aha, uh -huh, a Hylian. Yes, I knew it. Oh, pardon me. I am Sidon, the Zora Prince. <laughs> In another life, I was known as Kamina. <laughs> and what is your name? Go on, please tell me. Link? Your name is Link? Fantastic name. Hmm. 
though I cannot shake the feeling that I have heard it somewhere before. Well, in any case, it is a strong name. To be honest, I've been watching you. I've seen the way you work. I can tell by how you carry yourself you're an ordinary person. Link! You must be a strong warrior among Hylians, correct? Eh... Uh, sure. Uh-huh! Just as I suspected! I am Zor Prince, after all. I have an eye for talent that is unparalleled. Yes! Exquisite! I have been searching for someone like you for a long while. A man like you, Link, who carries himself with power. Right now, Zor's domain is in grave danger because of the massive rainfall coming from divine beast Valruta. Please, promise you'll help us. We need your strength, warrior. Won't you please come to Zora's domain with me? <laughs> wow, really? <laughs> Thank you, Link. You are indeed the man I thought you were. Now, Zora's domain will be saved for certain. No time to waste. Hurry up and head over. Because of the rain, the cliffs are too wet to climb. <coughs> Plot device. To reach the domain, you will need to go straight along this path. As a Hylian, I know you are unable to swim up the river. As such, the path to the domain may be a bit treacherous. You likely have a tough fight in store. There are monsters up ahead that attack with electricity. Oh. Don't give up. I believe in you. Oh, that's right. I would have something that I would like to give you. This is just a small trinket to show you that I have faith in you. Oh. It is a drink that will increase your resistance to electricity. I'm not sure why, but its effects do not seem to work for Zora. Perhaps because it was made specifically for Hylians. It should work wonders for you, though. I shall go on ahead and make sure there's nothing strange going on where you're headed. I'm counting on you. The ever charismatic Shark Man. Shark Man. A one-man tornado. In fact, a sharknado. <laughs> no, but Sidon's pretty cool. Who who doesn't Shh, be very quiet, I am hunting Octowox. Come on. Yeah, that's what I thought. Ah, what was that? Why did my pet Octorok just die? Oh shit! <laughs> Get fucked. Come on. How does a Phil get hit in the face with a club? Right on the freaking nose, too. Man, it's gotta hurt. Yes, give me those damn arrows. God knows I need them. Oh. For some reason, I saw the rock. I was like, yahaha? Korok? begin our long journey to Zora Domain. I like the Zoras in this game, though. They're like... Ed... Um, they're like... They kind of remind me of Twilight Princess Zoras, but a little bit less... I don't know. Tribal? If that's the right word I'm going for here. Holy crap, this river's fast. Let's get out of it. I don't, I don't want to swim in that. I can't swim in that, really. I'm almost... Oh, you're fast. I'm so glad they drop arrows pretty frequently because I need them. Oh look, more arrows. I don't want that. <laughs> mm. 
I don't want that either. It's like we need a huge 100 gallon barrel. What for? One apple. Chill. <laughs> nice sign. Dude, Octoroks in this game are not like the other Octoroks. They are really good shots. If you don't, like, dodge their attack, they hit you. Like that. <laughs> the ever-rare rupees. Like, you get so used to finding rupees, like, everywhere in other Zeldas, and then this one, it's just like, they're so rare. And jump in the water. Fishies! Now get out of the water before you get washed away. Sorry for calling to you out from the river. Since I pressured you into coming, I was not sure you'd really come though. Th through. Come through. Yes. I am pleased as things are going well. Ever since this strange occurrence, there have been lots of monsters around here. Please be careful as you proceed. And hurry. All oh, my fellow Zora are anxiously awaiting your arrival. <laughs> it's so, like, normal tone, and then he starts yelling. It's like, it's like God, what have I done? Oh, I thought that was a fish. It's a squirrel. God damn it. I picked that up thinking it was something else, but it was a stupid traveler bow. Almost killed me. It was you. Don't you just stick your tongue out at me. Why do I feel like that way's a trap? You're like a tougher version of Los Alphas, yet you have a shittier weapon than the other guy. Yeah, slice and dice.
Yeah, I'll take that bow. Man, I really need to upgrade slots for, uh... Oh, it's the same. Whatever. when they don't see it coming. It's like, huh? What? Where'd it go? Wait, where'd the sword go? What? Did it fall down? strange. I feel like I'm fucking blind. Where did the heck sword go? I just saw it bounce off the tree. It's an arrow. Okay, fine. Whatever. I didn't really want it anyway. Actually, yes, I did, but whatever. I'm not gonna go out of my way to keep looking for it. It probably despawned. There's a strange, like, sometimes things just randomly despawn, like that bear the other day. Boar, please. Do not ruin this for me. I'm trying to be sneaky. Please leave me alone, I didn't do anything! Oh my god. Get up! That was fucked. Sight. Those arrows are dangerous. I can't see what that aim. of like shock arrow people around here shock arrow is off us what was that guys don't know what you're doing and then there was one and he's dead thanks for the arrows saves me from having to buy them later Yep. <laughs> 
No, I'm trying to get the truffle, damn it. Shitty boxes. One arrow. Okay, there's some rupees. That's more like it. You can't carry any more bows. Make sure I'm still on the right path. Yes, I am. Good. What do we have over here? Oh, man. Oh, boy. Uh, go to this. I better hurry up and take care of these guys before the lightning gets all freaking crazy. Oh shit! Overkill, I know. You're the one I have to watch out for. Oh, shit. That flash just got me so scared. Oh, sadly, I have to use this. Listen, Lizalfos, for your own good, I would not be holding that metal thing right now. Funny, huh? Oh, you're a real joker. Please, before you get us all killed, just give me the spear. Oh, God. Wah! I'm a Lizalfos. It's all holding a metal spear in the air during a thunderstorm. Yeah, real smart, genius. Oh my god, that's exactly what I'm talking about! <laughs> oh my god, it's so... It's funny and yet scary at the same time. How powerful, like, nature is in this game. As it is in real life. That was weird. Why did it just randomly stop thundering? It was like just for that one little instance, and then it's like, nah, I'm gone. I bet that's a keys. Yep, those are keys. I'm not gonna mess with them. Don't really care. Oh, 
That's that steak? I want some steak. Oh wait, hang on. Some herb. It's always more important. Wasn't there a third one? Well, I guess if the thunderstorm's over... Oh, is that him? Did he just, like, run away? He's like, I'm safe over here at this fire that's, you know, ten feet away. What? Hang on, let me grab my... Sp a flaming whatever spear. Too bad. Give me that rusted bass. I love fish. kind of blew myself up. <clears throat> hey, Link. You're almost halfway to Zora's domain. Oh, by the way, there are a few spots up ahead with lots of enemies, but I'm sure you'll be fine. I believe in you, Link. Thanks. Although you're wasting my time. Nah, you're cool side on. Everyone likes side on, come on. The Amber's lost. Oh yeah! I feel like I'm Thor. Every time I kill a monster, it's like thunder happens. I keep expecting to see lightning. Oh, let's see here. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. I love picking up rocks and finding five bucks. Or five currency. off those trying to crush me with some stupid boulders all right motherfuckers whoa oh the fuck think that's gonna stop me don't you know I'm spider-man I think I came up this way another way last time but this works nice try Link, what are you aiming at? <laughs> what, what was he stabbing in the ground for? <laughs> that was crazy. Okay, I don't care about this thing. I want another spear. I can't help it. I really like spears in this game. sharp <laughs> oh 
Holy crap, that was a lot of apples. Hey guys, what's up? <gasps> Shit, I did not see that third one. That was my bad. Link, can you please face him? Thank you. Oh man, that is like makes you way more resistant. <laughs> Shocked his own dude. Man, you guys are ruthless. Oh. Gungier! Ah! Oh! oh, you are so dead. Like, <sighs> all right, for love of fuck, sometimes the only downside is controllers. I have to mash real hard right on the D-pad, otherwise it's just like, oh, did you mean up? Oh, fuck you. You were so- DIE! <laughs> Annoying cocksucker. You got shock arrows too? That's right. Run to me. Hey, where are you going? What? It's a great rainbow. Too bad I don't have any time to admire it. Now I'm just like, who has shock arrows and who doesn't? I'm gonna kill the archer guys first. Come on, fight me, bro. What are you mad about? What? Oh, you running away? You scared? Just like Buku's of weapons up here. All right, let me sort out what I want. Um, I don't need two of these. Fort, uh, reinforced shield. Those are pretty good. Let's drop this one. Octo rock balloon. Um, was all the... Okay. What the... Oh, yes, excellent. But I just heard a Los Alfos. Where... I heard him go, Clay! Did something land on his head? Where is he? Frog in this pond. Whoa, Amber is the color of this gemstone you found. Okay, what the actual hell? I heard him. Where is he? I 
I don't want to get blasted by another electric arrow, so... Oh, I see. Fleet Lotus Seeds. You can use that in actual mules, I think. If I remember right. Maybe it was the frogs I was hearing. I sure hope so. spear for now. I'm half tempted to actually get rid of this uh, ice wand. It comes in handy sometimes, but uh, you know, over a melee weapon, is it really worth it? Sorry, you lose. Oh. That's right, I have to drop it. Let's take another forked boomerang. sudden influx of weapons went from like being low to like having too many now even though they're mostly all like Lizofo Lizofo's forked boomerangs Topaz nice Hey, Fox. <laughs> Such an asshole. I need meat! <laughs> Fox McCloud. What's up, Sidon? <laughs> you are still pretty far off, my friend, but I was sure you'd be passing over this bridge, so I've been waiting for you. You'll be in Zora's domain before you know it. In fact, I'm going to head that way too. I shall meet you there. Whoa, Link! Beware, warrior! A monster approaches from behind you! It's my best Sidon voice I got. Where did you come from? Oh, that was the wrong jump for that. fucking defense on this champion's tunic is righteous because normally that would have killed me or like taken almost all of my life when he did that cleave yes yes cannot ever have any enough mushrooms mushrooms of all kind fish inside boxes. Fish and apples. Huh. 
Oh no. Is that what I think it is? A whiz robe. Hello. Bam. <laughs> Where's that? I, that one food I had, uh, that one bitch gave me. Did I eat it? No, I didn't. Here it is. Yes. Electro curry pilaf. I'll take that just because it's electricity and that can be useful. Oh. Well, oh, shit. Nice. Those boomerangs are pretty good in damage, but the problem is, is that, really, the wooden one didn't blow up? Uh, is you have to be, they're extremely close range. They're probably the shortest, like, handheld weapon in the game. And trust me, some fights you don't want to be up close and personal all the time. We're almost there, though. Oh, radish. Oh, I thought those were silent princesses. Damn it. You can never have too many of them. Especially since they're the only flower that really kind of grows in a special area. It has to be a mystical, you know, nostalgia area kind of thing. Oh, I see you, Moblin. I see you, Moblin. Oh. Ow, that hurt. Yep, and you're dead. I got my eye on you, Rock. Just in case you decide to turn into a stone talus. Wait, what are you? Come here. Aw, oh. oh, goddamn despawns. You gotta be fast with some of these lizards, because if you're not, they just despawn like that, like within a couple of steps. Oh, what's this? I never noticed this before. Nice. I totally did not see that chest the first time around. Oh, uh, frog committed suicide. Oh, you didn't see that coming, did you? My 
my collection of frogs is growing. Frogs are like, I'd rather die than go with you. Go into this town wielding the sword of their people so you know I'm friendly. And, you know, a Hylian. Are you a Hylian? Are you sure? Saved in a while. Oh, woodcutter's axe. I've been looking for something like that so I could have a weapon of. Man, I don't know. I don't need it that bad. I just, you know, like to carry something around like that, like that, or a sledgehammer so I can bust open rocks and boxes without having to blow everything up with bombs. But, whatever. It's cool. I don't have enough inventory space to have that kind of luxury yet, anyway. I need to find Hestu again. Shakalaka! Shakalaka! Shakala! Shakala, that's what he says. Shakala! Welcome to Zora's Domain. been waiting for you, Link. Welcome, behold the pride of my people, Zora's domain. Now I shall introduce you to the king. Hurry, this way. <laughs> Curb your enthusiasm, Sidon. I'm coming, I'm coming. First, I want to talk to everyone. Oh. Hylian, eh? I believe this is our first time meeting, yes? My name's Denma. You're female, right? Huh? My, how observant you are. Is there a problem? How old are you? <laughs> That's not an appropriate question to ask the lady you just met. She stabs you. <sighs> Let's just say I'm less than a hundred years old. Can't you tell? I'm so much less formal than the elders, aren't I? Hmm. At any rate, Zora's domain is looking for a Hylian warrior. For more detailed information, please go speak with King Dorfin in the bag. Like, dorsal fan? Huh? What is it? Master Link? Is it true you? The Hylian champion? It's me! R Riven. Rivan. That sounds better. We used to swim together when I was but a child, remember? Um... I don't. Well, it has been a hundred years since then, and now... I'm now over 130 years old. I must say, you've aged well for Hylian. Unbelievably well. Now that I think about it, shouldn't you be dead? <laughs> Sorry, that may be too personal a question. Uh. Father, we are on guard duty right now. All oh, right. Sorry. The leader of the pack, Baz. The heroine, Gaddison. And my father, Trello. They have all aged quite a bit, I'm afraid. But they are doing all well. They are all doing well. Oh, but Master Link, you probably shouldn't speak to the elderly. Oops, sorry for keeping you so long. If you have business in the throne room, right? Please proceed there at your earliest convenience. Oh. Oi, Hylian! You must be exhausted after your long journey. Oh, and as for me, I'm called Jared Leto. <laughs> But enough about me. Could I possibly oh. ask you to go and meet with King Dorfin? Oh. Dorfin? Dorfin? Dorfin. That sounds better. He's at the throne room. Please go ahead. Dorfin just sounds like endorphins. Hi. 
the flat. <laughs> but you're not the flat at all, aren't you? <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you a Hylian? <sighs> How many times am I going to be asked this question? Yes. Oh, where are my manners? I am Laflat. I am the chief secretary for the royal family. Mm -hmm. Are you curious about the statue of Lady Mifa? Ah. If you do not mind, please allow me to explain. This is a statue of the former Zora champion. Her name was Lady Mifa. She was as kind as she was beautiful. They say her ability to heal wounded soldiers was beyond compare. Those soldiers she healed, they are old and decrepit now, but they remember. For this reason, the elders of the domain all love Lady Mifa dearly. If you would like to know more, I suggest you try talking to one of them. Good day. I swear I've met you before. Welcome to Merit Mart. Could be Mero, but... This is where you'll find our general store, the Coral Reef, our workshop, the Hammerhead, is also here. Ooh. <laughs> they're the best shops ever! Together they're called... That's my theme song. Isn't it cute? Mm. <laughs> oh my god, it's a Goron. First Goron I meet. Hey, talk to me. No, wait, Goron. What? Will you not talk to me? Oh. Oh, hey. You're a Hylian, aren't you? It's rare to see your kind around here. As for me, I was roaming nearby during my travels when Prince Sidon recruited me and brought me here. That's because I could touch shock arrows. But I also weigh, well, a lot. There's no way I'll be able to carry you on my back. That's what Prince Sidon said to me. It was kind of rude of him, wasn't it? <laughs> don't, don't let it bug you, man. Yeah, let me grill you. Not literally, but on questions. Where are you from? Hmm. I'm from Goron City. It's near Death Mountain. But Zor's domain is pretty amazing, too. What is falling down from the sky? Imagine that. Is this mm -hmm. something else you want to ask? Death Mountain. <laughs> what? You don't know about Death Mountain? On a sunny day, you can see the volcano anywhere from Hyrule. Us uh, Gorons eat rocks, you know, so it's really comfortable for us to live around Death Mountain. Something else you want to ask? You eat rocks? Well, I happen to know a couple of core rocks. That's right, they're the best. Rocks are great, but you know the gems, you know the sparkling ones? Those taste terrible, and we can't pass them through our intestines. Get us real constipated like. Nothing to do with those but sell them. Or use them as crafting materials in the old workshop. Mm. Something else you want to ask? Nope. Mm. That's all the options I got for you. Wow, you're ugly. So the Hylian who stole Lady Mifa away thinks he can just come wandering in here like nothing happened. What business do you have here after all these years? What's this place? Oh, the weapons workshop. What are you doing? Trident maintenance. A trident. The light scale trident, the ceremonial trident. You've been making your racket since you walked in here. There's no point coming here if you do not possess the light scale trident. Leave now. <sighs> All right, I'll buy something. Let's see, arrows. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Ah. I want to sell. Oh. Oh, ha. Ah. I have a lot of opals. Give me money. Oh. 
Hmm. So Sapphire sell the most. Rubies and Topaz. I don't want to sell these. I can part with some Opals, though. Let's do five. Oh. Oh, that's it. Goodbye. Oh. I see a shrine! I can't jump over? Damn. It's kind of lame. Or maybe I wasn't trying hard enough. Crab, crab! Sword. Yes, this one is better. Made by Nifty Zora Metal. Nifty Zora Metal never rusts. Or our name isn't Zora. How convenient. There's a shrine right smack dab in the middle of their domain. It makes it incredibly easy to teleport here in and out. Even more so than Kakariko. Pushing power. Niz Yoma. I think I know where this is heading. I vaguely remember this. Yep. Sorry, I wish I could have both, but... So be it. Let's get you out of the way, you two. I'm trying to remember how I did this last time right. This needs to be blocked off. Because you want it to go that way. Now, keep in mind, as with any shrine, there are multiple ways to solve it. This is just my method. Alright, alright, alright. Let's push it out. 
then up. <laughs> Womp. Alright, yeah, you still need to keep going, just let me... Ah, shit! I think I put that one too far forward. Let me smack that. Smack that! I'm sorry. I hate that song. I should keep rolling. Come on. fine. Hang on, hang on. Before I go down there and push it, let me just do one more thing. Uh, let's do right there. Oh, you son of a... Okay, wait. This might work. Might kill me, but I'm gonna try. Stop! No! Damn. It's gonna break it though. Hmm. Oh well, I'll just do it the old fashioned way. Maybe if I shatter that one, it won't actually break the final one. Roll, roll. Rock and roller. Oh, no. I made it just oh. fuck ever so fucking slightly wide. Just wide enough as a damn ball. Okay, that should not be wide enough. Smash. That's good. like pinball sort of so plays a mean pinball ready to fucking shoot another ice block if it doesn't stop it okay Wait a second. I remember what I'm doing wrong. Alright. I'm an idiot. I totally forgot about stasis. 
clearly is what I need here. Actually, before I get carried away, I forgot I need to make my block down here again. I'm sure there's an easier way to do this, but this is just how I did it, so... And I'm having to, like, re-remember this. Hey, zoom, zoom, zoom. Keep going. I'm not sure what that laser is for. And now, what I did was smash and then... Please don't go too terribly far. Oh! No! Oh, okay. <laughs> yep, that's how I did it last time, except that was a little bit closer to falling off the edge. Can't believe I forgot about stasis. I just don't use it that often. up to five again. Actually, before I continue on, let me just go quickly back to Kakariko and get another heart. Then I can teleport back here. Since you know, there's shrines right there and all. Hey, you. Do you recognize any other pictures? <laughs> well, I mean, yes. You're not wrong. Five hearts is so much better than four.
I'm very glad that your armor doesn't have a durability system. Suddenly, there's more Zoras here. <laughs> Good morning. Um, who are you? I'm a Hylian. Can't you tell? I asked because my... Oh, never mind. My dad told me not to talk to strangers. It's a little late for that. There's something else over here. What's going on? Uh, hello. Coda. Welcome to Seabed and here we... What's wrong? Could it be? Lenny? It is! It's Lenny! Lenny? You're Lenny. Wow, it's been such a long time. But I thought... Wait, but I thought you and Mifa fell to Calamity Ganon. And if you've been alive all this time, where have you been? What have you been doing? Please, tell me! Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm an adult, yet here I am making a ruckus. Has it really been a hundred years? In a way, it feels like yesterday. Oh. We've both been through a lot, I'm sure. If you don't mind, I'd love to catch up sometime soon. I don't remember you. Oh. This is a cooking area. We Zora mostly eat raw fish, but Hylians get much more benefit out of cooked food, right? Oh. Yes, I thought so. Wait, you eat raw fish? Isn't that cannibalism? Um... Okay. What are you doing? I'm so mad at her. I need to get to the bank of wishes to send a letter, but Mother won't let me go because of that water monster. She treats me like I'm a ch still a child. It's so condescending. <laughs> it's really terrible to be the awkward age, Zora age where I'm a young woman, but I haven't had my growth spurt yet. Just my luck to be a late bloomer. I'll probably never grow taller. Ugh! It's awful to be me sometimes. Well, Hylians don't have to... I doubt Hylians have to deal with some nonsense like this since you age so fast. You're so lucky. I don't know about that. Oh. I wouldn't put a lot of stock in that kid. You're a master link from a hundred years ago. <clears throat> Sorry, back to work I go. Oh. Oh. I was with that awkward like <laughs> He's like, oh you're Link? Oh, there's something weird going on there. Guess I'll go see the king. Hey, I remember you. Even though you kind of look like every other female Zora. I feel like we may or may not have met at the Zora River. I'm president of Prince Sidon's fan club. My name is Tula. Yes. fan club. Oh, there was a statue right there. <laughs> I don't think I've ever noticed it. Yeah, we did it. Wow, that guy's a stingray. And that guy's a whale. Mm -hmm. Ah, you must be the Hylian that Sidon brought here, correct? You did well to come all the way here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm King Dorfin, the ruler, Dorfin, ruler of the Zora. Hmm. That object upon your waist is that not a Sheikah slate? Mm hmm. Now that I've gotten a good look at who you are, at you, it's all too clear who you are. You're the, you're the Hylian Champion Link. Do not tell me you've forgotten me, the Hylian Champion. Oh, 
The Hylian champion? You cannot mean the Link, that champion. So that's where I've heard your name before. What a fateful coincidence that we should cross paths. <laughs> I cannot believe it. The Hylian champion Link has appeared before us. We have met numerous times, I'll have you know. Ah, oh, so many memories. My mind is overflowing with nostalgia, my friend. I had heard a terrible rumor that you had fallen in combat, but it appears you've managed to survive. Extraordinary. Been asleep. Come again? Sleeping, you say? Hmm, is that why you do not seem to remember me? But surely you must remember my precious daughter Mufa, yes? You do, do you not? Uh, Mifa who? I cannot believe it. Have you truly forgotten my dear Mifa as well? You and Mifa were so close, yet you do not remember her? Young hero, please look upon the beauty of Zora's domain. Do you see that statue? Does gazing upon Mifa's immortalized form still not jog your memory? Well, perhaps your memory will return in time. I dearly hope so. Father, I do not believe discussing my sister is helping matters at the moment. Link seems confused. Oh, yes, of course. But first, is it worth noting how remarkable it is that Sidon brought a champion here without realizing it? This is quite a feat, my boy. <laughs> That's a good one. Link, I doubt not that you still have endured a great many trials. Still, I must ask you to hear my plea. Now then, hero, I must inform you that Zora's domain is in grave danger of vanishing because of divine beast Valruta. I shall do you the courtesy of speaking bluntly. We alone cannot stop this beast. Will you lend us your strength? What? King Dorfin, my liege, please do not speak so. To ask a Hylian for help, why the very thought curls my fins. Mushu expe expected more of you. How can you still protest? Muzu, it is, it is rude to speak that way to your king and his guests. Link is here because I invited him. With such unprecedented rainfall, we have no choice but to rely on the aid of a trustworthy Hylian. Have we not already discussed this and arrived at that very conclusion? He is the key to saving Zora's domain. I have no doubt in my mind. Indeed, Link is a champion through and through. As things now stand, Zora's domain, nay, perhaps all of Hyrule, is doomed to be swallowed by the sea. This is bigger than all of us, my friend. Zora and Hylians alike must just put aside the all differences and band together. Have you forgotten already, my king? We cannot trust these lowly Hylians. A hundred years ago, they abused the power of an ancient civilization and turned Hyrule into what it is today. And that is not the least of it. Uh. It is their fault that Lady Mipha was lost to us. Link. The fine beast Varuta has a great power. He has a unique ability to create an endless supply of water. Of late, it has been mercilessly spouting water into the air. As a result, this area has been plagued by heavy rains. For Zora, water and air is one. So you'd think this not this would not be quite so critical of a problem. Sadly, the rains have filled the eastern reservoir nearly to the point of flooding. The reservoir burst is... As it soon will, I fear immense damage will not befall not only Zora's domain, but also the area downstream from us. There, Hylian lives are in very grave danger. Distant elephant noises.
divine beast Aruta. Your princess Zelda often studied the divine beast that is in the time before the Great Calamity. According to her research, the orbs located on Ruta's shoulders are me mechanisms that can control the water it generates. However, they require electricity to work. These orbs are clearly out of control now because there is no electricity coursing through them to stop them. Hmm. Sagan, who is quite a shock resistant for Azora, hit one with a shock arrow. Sure enough, it slowed the water a bit. Unfortunately, as an aquatic race, we Zora are terribly vulnerable to the power of electricity. Perhaps because we could not safely strike it with enough electricity at once, the water soon returned to its full force. Uh -huh. That is why I went in search of a Hylian who could help us. Link, I am certain you've already figured this out, but we need you to use shock arrows to get those orbs working properly again. Hmm. I will aid you in any way I can, of course. Please, Hira, I beg of you, help me stop Ruta's rampage of destruction. What? Princess Zelda herself to instructed you to aboard the Divine Beast and appease it from her then? So then Princess Zelda is still alive? I do not believe it. She was alive this whole time, just as you were. The events of a hundred years ago cannot be altered, it is true. But if we can regain to control the Divine Beast, then we may yet prove a useful and sealing calamity again once and for all. I did not know you had such grand ambitions, Link. Wondrous. Naturally, I shall help too. Once it has stopped rampaging, you can easily climb inside it. Come, Link, let us appease Ruta together. Thank you, Link. Truly, we are in your debt. Our goal is the same, and that means our meeting was nothing short of destiny. Now then, allow me to offer you this gift as a show of faith. So long as you wear this, you can ascend waterfalls just like a Zora. Please take good care of it. King Dorfin! Surely you do not really intend to give this outsider the Zora's armor. Countless generations of Zora princesses have gifted that armor to the one they were sworn to marry. Princess Mifa made that one there with her own hands. It is far too important to entrust us to a shady Hylian. He may be a champion. But Mifa had no such relationship with him, so why should he receive such an honor? This is just too much, my leaves. I do not understand it one bit. Hmm. Mm. That Muzu is not easily swayed once his mind is set. You must understand, he was in charge of educating my dear daughter, Mifa. Naturally, she means a lot to him, just as she means the world to us. Ever since we lost to the Calamity, he has grown to despise Hylians. I hope what you can forgive his rudeness. Hmm, but what shall we do now? I tasked Muzu with finding the shock arrows we will need to appease Varuta. Now he's rushed off in a huff. Link, do not let his concern do not let his words concern you. I will work this out with Muzu. I shall return shortly. Drama in the Fish Kingdom. Sidon, I suppose that means you're going to tell him. Link, Musu is most likely at the square down below. Would you mind going down there? I would like you to try to speak with him. Hey. There's the freaking Sidon fan club losing their shit. What? Oh, hey, it's you. I'm sorry, that other shield's just so ugly. all the way here, but it was in vain. I have no desire to speak with you. Listen well, Muzu. There is something you need to know. He who stands here, the man called Link, is the one whom my sister, Mifa, had feelings for. 
I was only a child then, so I did not know my, myself at the time, but it is so. I grew up hearing my father tell stories, some of which were about my sister's undying love for Hylian named Link. What? No! You, you cannot fool me with such a fanciful lie, not this Zora. How could Lady Mifa possibly have feelings for a Hylian like him? Facts are clear, he remembers nothing, even when he looks upon Princess Mifa's statue. It is the truth, Muzu. Even though you never knew it, he was ever in Mifa's heart. I was thinking, this reminds me of the time we first met. You were just a reckless child, always getting yourself hurt at every turn. Every time, I would heal you, just as I'm doing right now. I thought it was funny how, being a Hylian, you looked grown up so much faster than I did. I was... I was always willing to heal your wounds. Even back then. So if this Calamity Ganon does in fact return, what can we really do? We just don't seem to know much about what we'll be up against. But know this, that no matter how difficult this battle might get, if you, if anyone ever tries to do you harm, then I will heal you. No matter when, or how bad the wound, I hope you know that I will always protect you. Once this whole thing is over, maybe things can go back to how they used to be when we were young. You know, perhaps we could spend some time together. You can say that fish is a real keeper. <laughs> what is the matter, Link? Are you unwell? Hmm. You're quivering like a hatchling. Whatever is the matter? I remember. What? Do not mistake me for a fool, Hylian. There is no way you remembered her just now when it is most convenient. In any case, without solid proof, I cannot possibly take you at your word. If you have any such proof, now is the time to show it. Do so, and I... I shall tell you how to get those shock arrows. Yes, as well as anything else you wish to know. I jest, but that was a sweet cutscene. I like Mifa. Alright, dude, you don't believe me? Look. Muzu, look closely at the at the clothes Link is wearing. Huh? Hmm? You really think changing your clothes is gonna make me eh? What in the that is the sore armor from before? Lady Mifa made that by hand, and yet it fits you perfectly. What is the meaning of this? Now you understand, do you not? Now you know who her heart belonged to, and who she made this special armor for. The fact that this armor fits Link perfectly should be proof enough that Mifa made it for him and him alone. You have always disliked Hylians, even before the Great Calamity. That's why Mifa never told you. Now that you know, you must promise to help him save us all, Muzu. Please, tell us where we can find the shock arrows we need. Knowing you, I bet you've already figured it out. 
Hmm. I never would have imagined that she would make that special armor for one such as he. I do not approve of asking help from a Hylian, but I suppose it's our only option at this point. I am a proud Zora. That means I must take responsibility for my unwarranted behavior towards you. As promised, I shall tell you where you can collect as many shock arrows as you will need. In that tall mountain over yonder, it is called Bloimus Mountain, and there you will also find Shatterback Point. A terrifying creature has made its home up there. This awful beast shoots volley after volley of shock arrows. Even a single Zora, one could be fa even a single one could be fatal to a Zora. Aha! Uh -huh. You must mean that Lionel. He's a man beast. That one. That beast does indeed indeed wear shock arrows. That is certainly one way to collect them quickly. He is vicious, to be sure, but I am certain Link will rise up to the challenge. Uh. In order to appease the divine beast, I estimate you will need at least, hmm, at least twenty shock arrows. Do you think you can gather that many? Why do you still doubt him, Muzu? I have no doubt he will be triumphant. Okay, Link, let's get moving. The fastest way to Ploimus Mountain is to ascend the waterfall east of the domain. That Zora armor should come in handy. Just swim up to the waterfall basin and then go up to the waterfall there. from there. I'll wait at the East Reservoir Lake, right by the Divine Beast, gather at least 20 shock arrows, and then come and join me. <laughs> Wonderful! To get. Together we shall stop the D Divine Beast onslaught. Oh, he does have a sword. Ugh, I was getting all tongue-tied at the end. <laughs> It's fun doing voices, but in extended conversations like that, it's just, well, blah, 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 you know, that's kind of how I start feeling. Zora fish voice. I will say, I'm doing a hell of a lot better collecting materials this time around. Wait, so what happens if I... No, no, no. Hold. Crab plus fish plus salt and herb. <laughs> Salt grilled crab. Man, that sounds delicious. I think this will be the last bit I do for tonight. Oh. 
hearty salt grilled meat. It's a good reason I'm cooking too, because that Lionel they're talking about was the same Lionel we saw at that gate, and god if that's not a fucking tough battle, I know what's coming up. So I'm trying to kind of, you know, be ready for it. Steamed fish. Well, shit. It's not exactly what I was trying to make, but alright. Meat. This. And shroom. Glazed mushrooms. That sounds fucking delicious, actually. I don't think I would, I've ever had anything like that. So it's just like, if you overpower anything with mushrooms, it just kind of turns into mushroom this. <laughs> Sneaky fruit and <laughs> mushroom mix. I'm gonna make the most stealthy thing I can. Super sneaky mushroom mix. <laughs> Ten minutes of stealth. Alright, that's a good amount of cooking for now. So we made it to Zora, and we made some good progress, so I'm excited because next time we'll do the whole shock arrow thing, and then we'll go to Divine Beast Varuta and continue on from there. So let's save. Right next to freaking Coda, yeah. DLC. We'll have to check that out. I didn't even see that was an option until just now. Looks like, man, I'm beat. <clears throat> so, yeah. Uh, I will see y'all next time.